Hello and welcome to another video from Double Rail. In this video, uh, we're going to run two black fives in uh, double head configuration around the layout. Um, this is just a test that I'm doing. Um, basically, here we have uh, two uh, black fives. We got a four five one nine two and four five four two two, and they're both Hornby. Uh, I think they're both from um, the uh, 80s or early 90s, and um, they're running off the old. 1960s, 1950s, Trying Railways, Lion Brothers, uh, Canadian dual high-end uh, power controller, and it's uh, capable of kicking out a fair amount of uh, fair amount of amps. Um, both of these uh, Hornby uh, Black Fives are tender driven, and um, will they've been relatively uh, serviced, so um, they should both be kicking out about the same amount of power, and so hopefully there's no pushing and pulling too much and um, hopefully there's there, there won't be any problems. Um, we're using just one output of the uh, DC controller and basically um, the reason I'm running this video is um, I'm experimenting with uh, switching camera angles around the layout um, over the next couple of weeks. I'm going to be doing a lot more scenery and a lot more work um, over the Christmas period um, on the layout. And so what I'm hoping to do is when I do these videos, you're going to get a little bit more to lay out, not just this uh, one section. So I have an awful lot of scenery work to do, but uh, as you'll see here in a minute. But um, hopefully you guys will, will like this video and uh, we'll use it as a baseline. So over the coming weeks, uh, when I do layout updates, I'm going to try to do the similar kind of camera angles. Um, today I'm filming this with the uh, Canon uh, HD uh, camcorder. Um, but in the future, I'm hoping to mount some permanent web cameras uh, around different sections of the layout. Um, so if there's a particular camera angle you really like that you see in this video, uh, note the uh, time index and put a comment in and I'll uh, take that into consideration when I'm installing the web cameras in a few weeks. And um, if you haven't guessed already, yes, what I'm aiming to do is, uh, and it'll take me a while, but I'm aiming to use these particular camera angles and switch them. Uh, from view to view to view uh, during the live events. Uh, I know I haven't done a live event in a few weeks, um, but that's the plan. So I'm hoping to, to make the uh, live events a little bit more interesting so you can follow the locomotives around the layouts. All right, so uh, we're gonna get started here and uh, hopefully you'll enjoy this video. 